WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 10 a.m. Eastern Time on Wednesday, 30 minutes in the trading day, and we have quite a start to the downside. S&Ps right now negative by 48 points, trading at 2883. We get the Dow Jones negative by 391, trading at 25888, and the Nasdaq off 132.7884. Gold trading higher, up nine dollars at fifteen twenty-three. Notes and bonds, quite the story of the day. Higher price and lower yield. We got the thirty-year at a record low yield, two point zero one five percent. We have the ten-year and the two-year yield curve inverting for the first time since two thousand and seven. And with that in mind, we got the ten-year up fifteen ticks, one thirty ten. Thirty-year up a full point and twelve ticks, one sixty four ten. And the dollar index up eighty-nine ticks at ninety-seven seven twenty. Start it off, we'll jump over the charts, and we will start things off with the Dow. Quite a decline. Things really begin at about 2.30 a.m. Eastern Time. We're trading at 26,307. Check out that run. You're now down about 450 points from that price level, trading 25,851. NASDAQ 100, overnight, up there at about 7,750. Check that out. We just reached 7,600, 150 NASDAQ 100 points. S&P 500 was up there at 2930, about 50 S&P points, currently trading 2881. Gold contract, a bit of an inverse of those charts. We have the gold contract trading at 1523, trading higher from most of the session after pulling back yesterday. And crude oil pulling back a bit. Check out that volatility as well. Quite a day for crude yesterday, hitting a high of 57.43 and we're down about 200 and, uh, excuse me two dollars and fifty cents from that price level at 54.92 we're going to get the eia numbers half hour from right now at 10 30 a.m and the euro us dollar trading at 111.58 in terms of what else you have happening in the market quite a morning for macy's as they disappoint and they're down about 17 percent they cut cut their outlook and to scroll down to where we are at their forecast in the range of 285 to 305 and that is down 20 cents. So they're talking about diluted profit and uh, Macy's to pull up that chart. There you go, down 18.23 percent, trading at 15.89 Macy's. Retail, tough sector. We get Walmart. Their numbers out tomorrow. We'll see what happens there. Stay tuned, folks. Come back at 10 o'clock with Tom. We get that oil number EIA at 10:30. Kevin Inks, Alex Coffey, the team at TD Ameritrade Network at 11. Basil Chapman, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien, all this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back.